Hey guys, Silver Praetorian here, and I kind of wanted to bypass those rooms I went into last episode to get the flame thrower, because I thought I could just take that shortcut back to where we got the grapple beam, but it occurs to me that I cannot, because there are power-ups this way that I totally failed to get. Like this right here, if we power bomb this, and uh, right there it is, there's a missile expansion behind that door. Kind of forgot about that. Should have been able to grab it last time, but those shadow troopers committed suicide, and I don't care. Actually, I wonder if we could probably do power bombs affect the special troopers. I wonder. Let's find out. No, it does not look like it. Well, I have enough health. I can kind of just bypass all of them forever because they don't really hurt too terribly much. See, this is what happens when I'm on normal mode. Stuff doesn't hurt enough, especially at the end of the game when I have enough health just to tank my way through it, and I just bypass everything. And I want my strong health. But I cannot have a stronger boost ball. And I need to be. Come on, jump through the hole. Okay, I don't think there's anything in this room. Except, uh, Shadow Troopers? Shadow Troopers? Well, there were Shadow Troopers, but there aren't. Well, yeah, there were Shadow Troopers. There are not after I've been... Yeah, I, I don't even know what I was trying to do. But you! I keep forgetting about you. This is a mini-boss fight. We blow that up with a power bomb. And we release him. This is the Phazon Elite. I think that's what it is. Are you the Phazon Elite? You're the Phazon Elite, correct? He is the Phazon Elite. One time only creature. Make sure you scan him. He kind of likes to do this as well. So he's a little obnoxious. But I'm probably going to try to burn him. Because this is very, very powerful. Very, very powerful. Though how he just kind of counter everything I do kind of makes me want not want to use it. So I'm just going to keep rapid firing to death. He's basically just your standard pirate with no real more tricks behind him. Just kick his butt. He's not that big of a threat. I don't think so anyway. This has a decent bit of health. But upon killing him... There is an artifact released that we kind of needed to get. So that's an artifact that we didn't have before. Nice and simple. Which only leaves one more artifact to get. And we can't get that yet. And with him dead, these platforms come back down so we can climb right back up. Did I scan you? Good, I scanned the super turrets. And the super turrets need to die. A charge shot kills them, though. I did not remember that a single charge shot can kill these. Let's see now. I already got the power-up that was behind this wall over here. Yeah, that's a power-up I would have gotten. I would not have forgotten about that power-up, so I don't need to check. And just drop down through here. And into this room, which we could not bypass because horribleness. Let's see, now we just want to get up to the ice door on the second level. Or third level, actually. This is the fourth level we're up to. But now that I'm up here at the very top, I can kind of just drop on down and not worry about it. Nice. And we are now down here. I... Oh wow, I completely avoided them. I didn't have to worry about them at all. Elevator time. Taking the elevator. Which drops us off in a room with a thing. Not too worried about that, actually. Shouldn't be too bad at all to deal with. But we just get to advance that through here. Gonna jump up and launch a missile. Killing these pirates the easy way again. 
because they're not the smartest pirates ever. And yep, Shadow Troopers. But I was ready for them. They never stood a chance. Never stood a chance. Okay then, so with those pirates dead, we just need to come up and around. And up and around. And up and around. I should stop repeating my... More Shadow Troopers. Shadow Troopers are really not a threat to the Plasma Beam. That's why they give you this weapon so late in the game. It is that powerful. And that is why it's my favorite weapon. Alright then. So in here is the room with the map room. Is that a white door ahead of us? I think it's going to be a white door. Because I don't feel like fighting the dudes that are in this room. And it's a white door. Awesome. Just get to drop down through here. But yeah, that um, that elite pirate, I keep forgetting what room it's in. Every time I play this game, I always forget which room... Oh yeah, you kind of free yourself after a point. And then we have to deal with you. You're just a scan... No, you're not. Did I not scan elite pirates? I could have sworn I scanned elite pirates. I thought. Huh. Oh well. Not terribly concerned. And then we have ice pirates. Which are totally not a major threat. Usually. No, I don't even really need to fight these guys. Oh yeah, you got a double kill though. That's nice. Okay, so all of those guys are dead, leaving not a threat to us at all. And now we can advance through this bomb blocked off door by bombing it. Oh. Well now, this could be difficult. Not really. Just back here, underneath the floor, up through this hole, and continue to hide back here. And we can just deactivate all of them. Totally not a threat at all. Kind of funny how not a threat that is. Now then, if I recall, there's a power-up in this room. We can also kind of not have to deal with these space pirates. Because there are Metroids. Let's see, force field disengaged, and we've released the Metroids. Those space pirates are kind of dead forever. Oh, hey there. I kind of don't feel like dealing with you. Or the Metroid, for that matter. But I have Ice Beam, and I have Missiles, so I don't need to. Now that I know there's a power-up in this room. Hmm. Phase on underneath us. I know there's a power-up in this room. I will find it. Hmm. I will see you guys when I find this power up, because I know there's a power up in this room, damn it. And I will find it. See y'all in a minute. Space pirates antagonizing Metroids. Can anyone say too dumb to live? So it occurs to me that that power-up is further in. So, um, let's go further in. Anyway, just turn on the x-ray scope here and we can see these invisible platforms. I suppose... No, yeah, yeah, you, you do kind of need the x-ray scope to beat the game, I think. Pretty damn sure you need it. And we can just kill that Metroid. Totally not a threat. Uh, anything... More invisible platforms. And let's just jump over here. Whoa. Well now. That's interesting. Just power bomb that. Power bomb this. I know I can power bomb this. And beyond here there is spider ball track. Uh, this is probably where that power-up I was thinking of is. Need more x-ray? 
More x-ray scope. Haha. -ha. Okay, now we just gotta wait. Wait and go up. Here it is. Anyway, this video is probably gonna be long enough right here, so next time we will continue and go deeper still into the phase on mines and see what awaits us at the very bottom. Let's hope I make this jump. And I make it. Alright guys, I will see you all later.